Uh, hi, my name's Max Williams. Um, I'm a writer, a mentor with the ICANN Network. Um, I also work with Meals on Wheels with um, other support groups such as Different Journeys and Asperger's Victoria. My father passed away when I was 18. At a similar point in my life, around 18, 19, I was actually housebound for a while because my obsessive compulsive disorder was so overwhelming that it was just too frightening for me to go out into the outside world. Um, and recently, I'm currently dealing with um, being treated for um, a malignant nerve sheath tumour. And the whole situation with COVID-19 is incredibly difficult for me as well because since I was a kid, my two biggest fears have been cancer and a pandemic, and now they're both happening at the same time. We talk a lot about accepting and respecting others, which is hugely important. But maybe something we don't talk about enough is accepting and respecting ourselves. Um, and a big part of that is being proud of who we are and being proud of our strengths. Uh, because everybody, every single person has strengths, things that they're great at. And if you're not sure what yours are, they're usually the things that you really love. And for those of us who are autistic, our autism is an inseparable part of who we are. And as a result, it's also an inseparable part and aspect of our strengths. I had to move out of home to go to university because I come from a very small country town out in East Gippsland. So I had to travel five hours away from my family and I'd never been away from home for more than a few weeks at a time and go and live on campus in Melbourne. And in the months leading up to it, I just thought I'd last a few weeks and then just drop out because that seemed impossible to me. I didn't think that I could do that. So it was a bit of a trial by fire. It was very difficult. If I had to give advice to anyone else in the same situation, it would be to familiarise yourself with the place as much as possible. Go there beforehand, visit there, you know, if possible, get to, you know, get in touch with um, teachers and stuff beforehand so they're aware of your situation and you know them and the place is not a familiar and frightening environment um, because that helps a huge amount as well. You are more capable than you think you are because most people I've met in my life don't realise just how capable and just how amazing they are. There is so much good in the world and it's so easy to get caught up in the things that hurt, the things that make us sad. But um, I tr try to think about it like, you know, like a night sky, like, you know, the clouds, dark clouds may pass, but the stars are always gonna be there shining behind them. And, you know, even though you can't see the sunrise at midnight, it doesn't mean it's not coming.